our nursing and simulator demo unit. So I'll be presenting to you the features, all the accessories, and at the same time, kung ano pa po yung mga kailangan yung malaman with regards to the nursing hand. So first of all, allow me to welcome you to our nursing hand. So our nursing hand, uh, the height of our nursing hand is 5'7". Okay? At saka yung weight po niya is 32 kilos lang siya. So madali po siyang i-transport and transport. And then, I'll walk you through from head to toe. Gaya nung nakita nyo po sa video ko kanina, the wig itself or yung hair po ng ating nursing aunt can be interchangeable. So, pwede siyang black, patulad itong ginamit namin. Or meron po tayong second option, white naman. Tapos meron din pong option na blonde hair. So, nagay ko lang po sa And then, for the eyes, as you can see, blinking eyes po yung ating nursing aunt. And, pwede po natin siyang palitan. It can be blue or brown. So, nandito rin po yung pamalit. Ayan. So, may contact lens si Nursing Ann. Hindi nagpapalit. Then, meron din po siyang NG insertion or nasogastric. Tapos, meron din po siyang orogastric or OG insertion. Tracheostomy. And then, yung Bibig po niya where the sounds would come from. So, meron po siyang vocal sounds. Later on, kapag pinresent po ni Dr. Arlene, you will hear everything na kaya or capable si Nursing Ann. And, since, open ko lang po yung kanyang gown. Yan. So, gaya po nang nakita niyo sa video kanina, very realistic po. It can be articulated. Pwede din po siyang paupuin. Medyo mabigat lang. <laughs> Yan. So, ito po yung kanyang tracheostomy. Dito na po tayo sa my throat. So, pwede siya for tracheostomy. And also, we have, kung makikita niyo po, sorry, nabubolden ko siya. Meron po siyang bilateral pre-ported IV insertions. Both side po ito. Aside from that, lahat po ng pulse pulses are available. Carotid. And at the same time, spontaneous yung breathing ng ating nursing aunt. Excited na si doktora mag-discuss. And then, brachial, brachial I should say, na pulse. And then, meron siyang radial. Going down, meron din po siyang sa femur. I think dito sa side na to. Yan. Pwede po tayong mag-inject dito. Yan. May kita nyo po may mga wire. Sa technical side, i-discuss po yan ni Engineer LJ Baker. Then, gaya po ng sinabi ko, articulated po even the legs of our nursing line. And, meron din po siyang bilateral pedal pulses. Both sides po ito. Okay? Tapos, sa loob naman, Actually, for every unit po, may kasama na siyang gown. So, pag in-open po natin, makikita niyo po lahat. Later on, ipapakita po ni Dr. Arvin ang mga scenarios and clinical practices. Additional accessories po ng ating nursing aunt. Meron din naman pong interchangeable. Interchangeable genitalia. So, pwede siyang male. 
although hindi na ganyan yung hair niya. Ayan. Tapos kung mapapansin nyo yung side, may zipper all throughout sa head. Ito po. So, yung anatomical um, view ng ating nursing aunt or simulator. And by the way, our nursing aunt is the very low-cost simulator na high fidelity na rin po. Sige, habang inaayos ko po siya, I'll walk you through the accessories. Together with the nursing aunt simulator or mannequin itself, it comes with a SIM pad. Ito po, ating SIM pad. Option po, it's either the SIM pad, this is to navigate, your nursing hand sa mga scenarios, clinical practices, or patient monitor. So, it's an option lang po. Pwede din namang dalawa sila. But then, since this is our demo unit, so we completed the set. Okay. And, and po siya. Ito yung ating simpad bag. Plus, all the accessories that comes with the nursing hand para sa mga scenarios. Meron po tayong hair cock. Meron po tayong hair filter. Mamaya, kapag may scenario na, pwede pong palitan yung hair filter. Meron po siyang dalawang uh, set. Then, our IV bag. Ito po, IV bag. IV tube. IV tube. Yeah. And then, uh, syringe. For feeding. Ito po. Tapos, ito for the blood coloring lang. And sa pagkiklin, pagkiklin, take care of our mannequin, will be discussed by your engineer LJ. So, pwede po siyang tanggalin namanya. Tapos, meron din po tayong lubricant. Ito po. And then, since for nursing po ito, proper care, Meron din po tayo mga for dressing ng mga wounds. So, ito po. Silicone dressing base. Silicone dressing. Iba't ibang sizes po ng mga silicone dressing. Then, meron po tayo subcutaneous injection pods. The pumps to it. Urine bag. Ito the wing bag and then ah, ito yung ating to change the eyes po into brown or blue color so, ito po yung mga accessories all these accessories comes together with the nursing hand package and it's an option for you if you want to make it with the same pad Sing pad kasi it's easier to navigate. Tapos lalo na po kapag sa class or face-to-face -face na tayo with the students, you can use the sing pad and you should you can hide this to your students. Gawa kayo ng mga scenarios. Then it's for them to guess or to identify. Yeah. While the patient monitor, uh, connect ko lang po. Hold on a bit. Kasi it will be realistic kapag meron po siyang sariling blan. Naririnig niyo po? So, naka-normal tayo. Or healthy mannequin. para tayong nasa hospital set up. Lalo na kapag may patient monitor. Now, I'll show you some cases from the one with the heart issues. If heart rhythm on the patient, on your students, you can just click heart rhythm. different kinds of rhythm. We have the sinus, the atrial tachycardia, we have the VTAC type 1, 
ventricular fibrillation, sinus uh, premature ventricular contraction, and the asystole. So your students will not just learn this in the books, they can see it in the monitor. So if you want to show them an, an atrial tachycardia, you just click and then activate. As you can see in the monitor, there's already a faster heartbeat. And there is a sound that's alarming. So your nursing student will be aware that there's a problem on the patient. Now if you want to end it, you just press the button end. If you want to show an all normal again, just activate the all normal and you will see in the monitor that the heart rate is already back, going back slowly to a normal heart rate. Now let's go to heart sound. In the heart sound, you can see normal uh, sound for aortic stenosis, Austin Flint murmur, friction rub, mitral valve prolapse, systolic murmur, diastolic murmur, and open snap 70 milliseconds. So, in the actual nursing rotation, actually, this is a very hard. hard topic or, or it's very hard to show a patient with all of this or even in the whole hospital so this would already show you actually we need a stethoscope to be able to appreciate the sound but I can activate it so you can see and then all you have to do is get a stethoscope Appreciate the hard sound. You need a stethoscope, and uh, in other centers that we went to, they have the. I don't know if you also have for in your school the one with the multiple stethoscopes. So your the earpiece will be distributed to several students, and they can auscultate all at the same time. And then you can show. Uh, also let them hear the different sounds. However, since you cannot appreciate at the moment, so I just have to tell you briefly about it. And then maybe you can, you can visit us here in Manila or we, we will be allowed to visit you. We can bring the unit to your school to demonstrate it in actual. Now you can also go to the lungs and check the respiratory rates. If you want to adjust to a faster respiratory rate, you can do that. Also, you can also show them different heart sounds. Uh, this is also very difficult to establish in an actual patient. So this, you can see, there are anterior lung sounds. Or you can show the lower right anterior, anterior normal. Or you can go to the posterior lung sound. So if we want to create a scenario, we can also show if you see, we can also show the normal lung pop has the sinus, the heart rate, the oxygenation is adequate, 
The respiratory rate is normal and the temperature of the patient is 37.2. The blood pressure is also indicated. So if you're going to demonstrate how you're going to take a blood pressure to your students, they will just put on the cuff and then you take it and then the, wear the stethoscope and put it in the brachial artery. If they want, you want to make them listen to a bubble sound, you can also activate. If you want the bubble sounds to be heard on the upper left, you can do that also. And the eyes, you can also show if you want to blink normal or blink slow. But he can cough. He can vomit. And you can tell your student to ask a question. For example, do um, you have fever? your breakfast yeah. and you can also show them if the, the mannequin has a shortness of breath Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please don't forget to thumbs up, share and subscribe. God bless and stay safe.